really need that that sick go really I don't really need that just sick go really I don't really need that that sick go really I don't really need that 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 I don't really need Man, oh my god, what a day. I think I'm going to wear this tomorrow. Because we're going to be massacring BGLC. We're going to go full trans massacre. I'm going to identify as a trans massacre tomorrow. A trans slayer. It still sounds cool. Trans slayer. You give trans am a bad fucking name though. What up, everybody? Alright, sit still now, dude. You going to stay there? Huh? Cool. Comment below if you want me to wear that tomorrow live, 7 a.m. That's 7 a.m. Um, Central Time, by the way. I'm in Alabama. Tune in tomorrow, 7 a.m. Uh, here's the uh, guts and the glory. BGLC is probably going to list at 8.45 a.m. Central Time tomorrow. Where do you live? Do you live in New York? You suck. That's where I came from. I came from fucking New York. I didn't know how shitty liberal it was, though, when I was living there, but damn. Anyway, I don't really give a fuck right now. If you're liberal, conservative, whatever, just make sure you're playing BGLC. Make that fucking money, all right? Be in my live tomorrow at 7 a.m. Central time, because I'm in the very conservative Alabama state. Red, baby. Yes. As red as that motherfucker's lips. Listen, if you're not in my live tomorrow, I'm just going to assume that you're, like, on Lou's channel in his, like, live circle jerk fest. You know, that's what Lou does. Dry. The Dry Circle Jerk Fest. Starring Lou from Wall Street. Anyway, let's get to the fucking other shit. It's a 10-1 split. Uh, we're going to pull ATXG money, hopefully tomorrow. Everybody's asking me all these questions. And I saved a lot of people from stock twits today. You're welcome. Stock twits is a total disease. Misinformation. Bots. Nobody gives a fuck about you on stock twits. All right? I can't believe the straight out fucking lies because a motherfucker's short in a stock or somebody's coming in hot and they're trying to give you misinformation so they can make money nobody cares about you on stock twits okay my discord links below because i care about you i'm helping you make fucking money i'm like i'm forcing you to the water but i cannot force you to drink i am forcing you to the water you're probably going to, you know, have Lou's channel in the background with your dick in your fucking hand while you watch BGLC blow up and you didn't buy because Lou told you Teddy just pumps Hong Kong stocks and they don't make anybody money. But you see, no, Lou didn't make any fucking money because he didn't buy PWM like Teddy suggested. Anyway, this isn't financial advice. Do whatever the fuck you want. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm going to be wearing this costume tomorrow. So if you take financial advice... From the Trans Massacre Slayer? That's your problem. Anyway, let's talk about the ATXG money we hopefully stand to make. Everything is identical with ATXG. ATXG had warrants. It was an uplisting. It was Network One Financial. It did a reverse split. It had all the goods. It's the same shit. Same exact shit as BGLC. This is BGLC is just part two ATXG. All right, and you're lucky because Network One Financial, they were frozen for a while. This is like their first big comeback, everybody. So don't you think they're going to throw this thing out and just nuke it to say, hey, everybody, we're back. I mean, who's not going to want to like hire Network One Financial to underwrite their IPOs? Like, doesn't everybody just fucking like, which that would water it down, that would dilute, you know, the goods. So why do that? doesn't really fucking matter there's another one coming after this the ipo next is in my discord so after bglc this is probably going to be a two to three day runner we're trading it a little different this time guys i'm not going like full out on day one this is a friday play you got a friday play they blow up but you have weekend hype you get all the stock twits fucking morons that didn't buy on day one they always buy on monday so they hype it up over the fucking weekend like, yeah, yeah, yeah. They think they're the first ones that fucking found it. They didn't know we bought it two weeks ago for like 40 cents. And, uh, but that's cool because stock twits turns these into like three day plays because they're late to the fucking game. It's all good. It's all good. Stock twits make us more money. Thank you. All right. Had you listened, you would have bought it for 40 cents though. You guys don't listen when it hit a buck 50 the other day on the OTC buck 50, 150% runner. Yeah. Anyway, uh, this is what's going to happen. Okay. I'm probably going to sell. I'm just going to outline this. 
What I usually do, you guys watch me trade. I always play it safe because I know a lot of people are watching me. I don't want to lose anybody fucking money. So when it starts running, we're, we're, we're checking that fucking momentum, incoming fucking buys, outgoing, what's level two. Everything's being fucking calculated. And then I go in for the fucking kill so that everybody can make maximum fucking money. On this one, it's probably going to be a little different story. I'm not doing maximum fucking kill on this one. Probably going to do like 50% kill. Hold off a little bit. Later in the day, 25% kill. Keep 25% in the fucking game for the Monday, Tuesday. You know those Monday morning quarterbacks over on Stock Twitch when they blow it the fuck back up and then round two everybody gets back in? I'm going to be a part of that shit. I ain't losing out. All right, I see what's up. So anyhow, join the party, guys. I'll be here tomorrow. And uh, comment below if you want if you want to see full trans massacre slayer. We're gonna eliminate trans though, cause that's just fucking. Ugh. You just want to go. Ugh. Like who the fuck takes their kids to trans story time? I'll if I keep talking, I'm gonna get demonetized. But that's fucked up, y'all. Fucked up that you think that's okay. Anyway, instead of getting off the topic, meet me tomorrow at 7 a.m. Live, baby. Live. We might even have some fucking booze for this shit because we got to celebrate. We're going to be celebrating early incoming fucking Lambos. 7 a.m. It's probably going to list at 8.45. Remember what I just said. 8.45 Central Time, which is 9.45. That means market opens at 8.30 here in Alabama. This puppy's going to list at 845 because it's an uplisting, not an IPO. If you ordered 1,000 shares, you're probably only going to get six. If you're lucky, five. 10-1 split. If you had 1,000 on the OTC, you're going to end up with 100. Good for you. That ain't fucking bad. I'm going to try to buy in limit order tomorrow, and I might only get a couple hundred. I could put a limit order in for 1,000, but they might only fill one or 200. You know what I'm saying? Because there's going to be ruckus. It's just going to be everybody fucking dogpiling in to get this. So, all the more money for all of us. So, I don't give a shit. If I end up with, like with Megal, I only ended up with 400 shares. But made, you know, I don't even know, close to 30 Gs on the very first day. Something like that. You guys remember, because I traded it live. That's it, guys. That's all I got to say, man. Dinner is upstairs. Got my granddaughter upstairs. Got my daughter upstairs. About to go chill. I will see you guys in the morning. Doge Warrior out, baby. Shaboom! Peace! <laughs>